There are so many offerings at this prime location connected by canals to the pristine waters of the Pumastone Passage and the Moreton Bay Marine Park. A first for our Sunshine Coast is the incredible dry boat stacker right behind me, uh, which can store up to 160 vessels. This is ideal for boaties living in apartments or smaller blocks and lifestyle villages who want to experience our world-class waterways and the lifestyle that that brings. The Pelican Waters Marina delivers many environmental benefits thanks to the specialised sewage pump-out system for boats, a tailored boat yard for marine repairs to manage waste and runoff, and marine berths versus boats on swing moorings in the Pumastone Passage which impact on the seagrasses through anchorage damage. This significant investment by the Pelican Waters Marina properties yet again demonstrates uh, investor confidence across the length and breadth of our Sunshine Coast and across a wide range of individual projects and industries. I declare this facility now open. So we have 127 berths in the wet berths in the in the water, uh, up to 15 metres, and then in the the dry shed you see that we're in here now, that's 160 boats up to 10 metres, so it's quite a big dry stack for Australia standards. And some of the advantages of dry storage is that you're out of UV light when you're not using it, it's in a secure locked shed, it has cameras in it as well. You can intensify the number of boats you can have together, so collectively we've got over 300 boats moored here in this area which is 20,000 metres compared to out on a passage where you might have 15 boats in that same area, taking up the same room, damaging the seabed. Sunshine Coast Council have been fantastic in helping us. And I think that just helps give your business and gives the project some oomph behind it that you've got the backing of the council. And, and I think that's pretty important from an investment point of view. Us and our business partners have spent a lot of money on this and it's comforting that you've got the support of one of the biggest councils in Australia. They've helped us out through some of the construction issues and planning issues that we had during this as well. So they've been fantastic.